Hello everyone! Today we're going to learn how to divide the circle into 48 equal parts. Let's start with our circle. I'm using a 5 cm radius, but you can use any radius you prefer. Next, I'm drawing my horizontal line. You can measure the distance, you can eyeball it, whatever works for you. Next thing, I'm using my initial radius and I'm going to draw two semicircles, one on the right and one on the left. Using the intersections between these semicircles and the uh, circle, I'm pointing my compass and drawing two marks up here and two below. Next, I'm aligning my ruler to the intersection of those four marks and drawing my vertical line. Again, make sure it passes through the center. Now that I have the intersection between the vertical line and the circle, I'm using the initial radius, pointing my compass and drawing another two semicircles which intersect the first two. Now I'm aligning my ruler to opposite points of intersections between the semicircles and the circle. Make sure your line passes through the center and doing it like this, I'm dividing my circle into 12 equal parts. Now that I have my 12-fold division, I'm grabbing my compass, using the initial radius, pointing the compass on the intersections between the semicircles, I'm drawing an arc inside the circle. Four arcs, actually. These four arcs intersect with the semicircles into eight points. And I'm going to use this red color to mark the points so that you can see them clearly. So what is left for us is to align the ruler to opposite points, making sure the line passes through the center and dividing our circle into 24 equal parts. I'm also adding the diagonal, which I forgot to do at the beginning. Now that I have my 24 fold division, let me show you how to divide it into 48. So this applies to any division that you want to do. If you take the distance between these two, make a mark, point the compass on one point and then on the other and do the same on the opposite side like this, you will find the center point. So if you align your ruler, your ruler to these to intersections. I'm using my pencil to align it better and I align it to the center as well. And then here you are. So this is your 48 fold vision. And now you just do the same on each intersection. So you just keep doing this. And by the way, I have used the distance between two points on the circumference, but that doesn't matter really. What matters is, is that you're using the same distance on both sides, on one side and the other, okay? So that you can find the middle point between the two. Uh, as you do when you want to find the vertical line, okay? As we did at the beginning, to find the vertical line, we use our compass and made two marks. So yep, yeah, this is how you do. Even if you want to do, I don't know, 96, which is 48 per two, 96 fold, 
you have your 48 fold division and then you just do use this method to divide it into 92 48 96 <laughs> oh my god mathematics so yeah this is what i'm doing here i'm adding the lines and as you can see i'm not going through the center even though my line aligns through the center but i'm not doing that because um it's, it becomes too crowded too messy so i'm just keeping it as clean as possible and i stop uh, a couple of millimeters before and start a couple of millimeters after the center point And here you are, your 48 full division. If you like this content, make sure to subscribe to my channel and see you next time. Bye.